Assalamu alaikum, dosdo. Hello. We're just, you know, roaming around the old Sadar area here in Karachi and developed a little, little, little bit of a hunger. So we passed this place which is called the Food Palace, right? And they have desi food and they have fast food. And I did tell myself for months now that I need to get a Zingle Burger. Zingo Burger is an invention of the old KFC, the Kentucky Fried Chicken, you know? The old Colonel, you know, he invented this, you know, because he wanted to make some money and was not sure what to do with those chickens. Anyway, in Pakistan, you see Zingo Burger everywhere. It's not, it's not like it's copyright or anything, right? Not at all. Of course, it's copyrighted, but nobody gives a damn. Kind of always wanted to try it, so let's try it. See, we got it. The old Zinger Burger. It looks like it looks at KFC. See, ah, oh, looks like a very nice. Actually, looks better than KFC. A little bit of coleslaw, Vedak. They were not gonna not gonna win any prize with the coleslaw. A little bit of fries, and you can have a, a soft drink, a cold drink. So like I always do, first try the fries, and the fries good. At least as good as at KFC. Was the fries? <laughs> okay. Good. Ah. All right. <laughs> Let's try that. Try that. Single burger. Ah. Oh, look, it is good, huh? Nice. Nice. It looks better than a KFC, that's for sure. And a KFC, they don't cut it for you. Oh. Mmm. 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 That's really good. That's much better than KFC. It's much better than KFC, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Mm. Nice meat. Boneless chicken. Mm. It has a little bit of a zing. You know, the old zinger burger. Ah, I like it. The burger. Very good. Is it, is, it, is it very similar to KFC Zinger Burger or? Yeah, it's been a while. It's, I like it. Yeah, it's good. It's definitely a good burger. Wow. It's 250 rupee with, with the fries and the coleslaw. Well, the coleslaw. Come on, let's try it. The coleslaw is a bit of a joke, I must say. It's just a little, a little bit. It's actually good, but. It was very small. It's a good, good cold stuff. Mm. Yeah, good flies. The Pakistanis sure know how to copy, right, breaking a copyright or whatever, copying a zinger burger. So, and they're also, they also have the zinger rolls. And I wanted to try that, so we have a like, little zinger party, all right? So let's try this. All right, so it's rolled into paper. Yeah, it is like a chapati with, you know, the same kind of foods inside, the same kind of chicken. You know, basically it's the same thing, like a burger, just rolled up, just in a chapati. This is Zinger Madness. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That is good. Mmm. I like this even better than the, the burger. <laughs> A Zinger roll. Why not? Man, it's brilliant. Yes, the 
this is fantastic. I mean, why not? How did this develop? Once upon a time, good old Colonel Sanders came to Pakistan, selling his chickens, his murgis. And then people said, well, that's pretty awesome. The old singer is pretty awesome, right? But we can do it without the old Colonel. So let's get rid of the Colonel. Why would we share with him? We don't need him around anymore, right? So basically they said, yeah, let's do it ourselves. And they did. And nobody hindered them. Nobody said anything about no, no copyright. And now you see Zinger Burgers in Zinger Rolls on almost every street corner in Pakistan. I like it. Screw the girl. Ah, eating Zinger makes you hot. Right, so this is the place, the food palace. It's actually pretty good. I like it. You know, you get all kinds of foods, fast food, daisy food. And of course, the zingers. The old singer food, see? But also, good old daisy food. Good old naan. All kinds of burgers. Yeah, I totally can recommend this place. And so this southern area, where we just, you know, had a good old look around and had this Zingo party is a great area. I love it here. Vibrant, you know, and full of history and old and new. And my Uber driver is not so new anymore, but he's a good one. Yeah, Rado from Switzerland, you know. I was shooting a little bit here. I, sh I would want to spend more time in this area, the area of Sadar, you know, also where the where the Empress Market is, and yeah, and these great big roads, these old roads, you know, which, see the old houses here, some of, some of them are really old, this is really old, it's breaking apart, I gotta love it, I love the area here, yeah, so we're taking an Uber back to where we're staying, which is also nice, you know, I like the beach, I like that, that lost feeling I have out there, you know, like, like, you know, kind of like it's almost like in a desert, and at the same time, it's that endless beach, the ocean that, you know, could... And now we had the Zinger Burger, and we had the markets, so I'm loving Karachi to pieces. This is actually a... I mean, I don't want to say it, but uh, it's almost like this is my favorite city. <laughs> I did like Lahore as well. Peshawar as well actually and I like the whole cities really think about it I mean of course Multan was cool but uh, yeah police protection you know that's like a no-go which is of course it's been cool in a way but you know I want to go back out by myself I got some mall here but Karachi is one of those you know one of those great like big old sub, you know, whatever, not, I don't want to say Indian, because it's Pakistan, but you know, like, one of the great city on the Indian subcontinent, you know, that reminds of, of Mumbai, also reminds sometimes a bit of Kolkata, and it's, it's very hard to pinpoint, but of course it's, it's its own thing, and I like it, I like that, I like that's vibrant, I could stay here for longer. I had similar feelings in Lahore. Here, yeah, the, the beach does it, and also, of course, the proximity to India, the proximity to Iran here, uptown. Yeah, I might as well film a little bit before we arrive. Karachi, the epitome of resilience, Karachi, the cricket city, and check out this cool place. That's a church. It's a nice park. I like it. Oh yeah, I do. Tradition is uh, a free hall. That's a nice park here. See some nice different areas. 
around Karachi. Yeah, you gotta love Karachi, man. I hereby declare Karachi sister city of my city of Basel in Switzerland. I don't know if I have jurisdiction to do that, but I'm still doing it. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Sue me? Check it out, there's the KFC. And there's the original Zinger. <laughs> In your face, guys. In your face, Colonel. Oh, a lot of wind. Karachi, the city of lights. Yes. Hey, cool, huh? Looks like in the outskirts of Paris. And he's a oh, nice driver, we still didn't die. That's good. If you have the opportunity to drive around a little bit, you know, might as well show, you know. We showed the Zinger now, we showed the Karachi, right? Ah, uh, this is this cricket. This is a cricket symbol there. The uh, Sahar. What does that mean? Uh, at the party of the People's Party. Ah, uh, this is for. Ah, uh, uh, this is a symbol of the party of the People's Party. But the People's Party is that not the one in charge. Uh, not in charge. But Jab, uh, Jab was in charge. He. Ah, ah, three ah, swords. Ah, there's a, ah, these are swords. I see three swords. Mm -hmm. That's a symbol of the People's Party. All right. But Imran Khan is he in the People's Party? No. No. Which one is he? PTI. PTI. Ah. Pakistan. Hurricane Saf. Ah. Yeah. Okay. All right. I didn't even know that. <laughs> but Imran Khan, okay? Oh yeah. I think he's good, huh? People like him. I think also I like him. And he was a good cricket player before. Oh. That, that speaks for him, I think. <laughs> That's uh, good for him. Uh, promotion for him. He was a very good cricket player. See, that's the People's Party. So these are communists. Is that not? The People's Party is not the Communist Party. No, no, no. no, no. The, but they are, they are right wing or left wing? Or middle? Regular? Hmm. Ah. All right. See what you learn. It's cool, I like it. They got the houses here. This is very European houses actually here. This as well. Yeah. The golf shopping mall. So you Uber driver for a long time? Yeah. How many years? Two and a half years. Two and a half. And before taxi? No. I have a pick and drop service for school. Man. Oh I see. Pick and drop. For school kids. School kids. Alright. So this is better or? This part-time job. You like this better? Oh yeah, that's better. Oh, this is just part-time? Part-time. Ah, okay. Are you, you still do pick up school for school, kids? No I more? Have a, I have another one. Ah, you have another? Ah, so this part-time and the other yes. job also part-time? Ah, very good. A little bit of change, that's good. Another shopping mall. So there's also some symbol here. Ah, uh, the three sword, that the two sword. Ah, but the same party. Same party. All right, so they like swords. Ah, the Pakistani People's Party, the PPA, no PP, PPP. 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 <laughs> I'm non-political. <laughs> and this this area is of course is called Clifton, but I do want to go to Clifton Beach and uh, Clifton Park. Anyway, you make a video. I think it's a pretty cool area. Anyway, guys, I don't want to bore you. You only want to see the Zinger stuff, right? <laughs> okay, take care. And fear me,